Scientists at the California Institute of Technology record a video using the world fastest camera at 10 trillion frames per second to capture the speed of light. The whole process takes eight hours. Laser light, which is why you don't really see anything else other than the light looking like that. And then we comp in the picture of the ball. In the room with my actual eye, it looked like it was constantly lit up, but here we're able to follow the light moving through the bottle. It may not look like it, but this is actually real. It's refracting the photo. This olive oil was taken from a wrecked ship known as the Stirling Castle which was run aground 180 years ago. The bottle was retrieved from the wreck. This is what the olive's oil has become after 180 years in a bottle at sea. 30 years ago and these were retrieved, a bottle full of olives from the wreck. So yeah, 130 years old, probably not going to be too fresh now, hence why I am wearing rubber gloves. But uh, there we are. That is what olives look like after 130 years have passed, which also is about the uh, amount of time it takes to get served in a lot of restaurants where I've had olives in the past. So, you know, I don't think this will be the last time I see them. Oh my god, ugh. This Google Babel Fish earbuds cost about $159, called Pixel Buds. It's work with Pixel smartphones and Google Translate app to produce practically real-time translation. One person wears the earbuds, while the other holds a phone. The earbud wearer speaks in his or her language, English is the default, and the app translates the talking and plays it aloud on the phone. The person holding the phone responds, this response is translated and played through the earbuds. Hey Isabel, how's it going? Hey Isabel, how are you? Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. What do you think of these cool new headphones? What do you think of these cool new headphones? My team designed them, so I think they're quite cool. My team designed them, so I think they're pretty cool. <laughs> All right. An albino grey white whale was encountered by a watching guide, reaching off the west coast of California, Mexico.
Aaron is an extreme wheelchair athlete, he performs tricks adapted from skateboarding and BMX. He uses a customized wheelchair, which is both lightweight and features four-wheel suspension. This enables him to perform the same sorts of tricks that skateboarders and BMXers can do. I have people come up to me all the time, like, can I pray for you? Or like, I'm so sorry, and I'm like, no, 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 like, please don't pray for me. I don't want to walk. This is way better, you know? Thanks for watching, I hope you liked today's video. Check back on Friday for another video like this.